Welcome to Motivation at Hand. To know is to know how. Make your foot the foot that counts. Sidereal skies, a deep celestial map. Stars etched in night's unyielding lap. Their silent songs a guide to cosmic lore. An ancient path to wisdom's open door. If we accept the premise that the age of Aquarius is starting around now, then in the year 2024, we are at the dawn of this new age within the great year. Describes a full cycle of approximately 25,772 years in which the Earth's axis gradually shifts. This would place us at a significant point of change in terms of astrological ages, symbolizing shifts in consciousness, technology, and society according to astrological tradition. The Dendera Zodiac is an ancient bar leaf from the ceiling of the portico of a chapel dedicated to Osiris in the Hathor Temple at Dendera, Egypt. Often cited as one of the earliest known detailed representations of the classical zodiac in its roughly modern form provides insights into how they viewed the cosmos. It depicts the 12 zodiac signs that are familiar today, including Aries, Taurus, Gemini, and so on, along with other astronomical symbols. The Temple of Dendera shows signs that an earlier structure once existed on this location, around 2250 BCE, possibly initiated during the rule of Pepi I, and finished in the era of his son, Mariner Nimtiams I. Additionally, there is evidence of a temple from the 18th dynasty, around 1500 BC. The Classical Greek period, 500 to 323 BC, epitomized by the era of Pericles in Athens. This period extended through the Hellenistic era that followed the conquests of Alexander the Great, ending around 31 BC when the Romans conquered Egypt. This suggests an integration of Greek and Roman astronomical knowledge with traditional Egyptian religious conceptions. The presence of the zodiac in an Egyptian temple illustrates the fusion of Greek and Egyptian scientific and religious ideas. Implications for the sidereal and tropical systems The Dendera zodiac remains a critical piece of evidence in understanding the diffusion of astronomical knowledge across cultures in the ancient Kush and the Mediterranean world and contributes to our understanding of how these systems were viewed and utilized in different historical and cultural contexts. Sidereal Astrology Indian Astrology or Jatisha which began to take its current form during the early centuries of the first millennium AD. This system relies on the fixed nature of the stars in the sky which have been used for centuries as a stable reference for locating positions on Earth. It uses the actual constellation in which the Sun is located at the time of birth as the reference point to determine astrological signs, particularly before the advent of modern navigational technologies like GPS. Global Positioning System was made available for civilian use starting on May 1, 2000 showing the length and breadth of sidereal astrology to mapping, navigation, and commerce. As to sidereal zodiac accounts for the precession of the equinoxes, which is the gradual shift of the Earth's rotational axis over 1,000 years. As a result, the astrological signs in this system shift about 1 degree every 72 years compared to their position in the tropical zodiac. Tropical Astrology Ptolemy's system made the tropical zodiac particularly relevant to cultures in temperate climates, where seasonal changes are distinct and significant, rather than actual star positions. This system is most commonly used in Western astrology. It sets the start of Aries with the vernal equinox, regardless of the constellation's current position in the sky. This approach is meant to symbolically reflect the human experience, tying astrological interpretations more closely to the earthly seasons and their metaphorical meanings. Each system offers a distinct framework, sidereal astrology aligns more closely with fixed astronomical positions, 
and frameworks became the basis for both scientific and astrological work in the Western tradition for over a millennium. Tropical realms trace the sun's bold course, marking time with nature's force. Seasonal shifts paint the year's grand arc, in radiant hues that light the dark. Much appreciation to you for giving of your time with us at Motivation at Hand. To know is to know how. We trust you will come back soon.